people think about Canada and they think about the foods that you can have here, some of the things that they think about most would be poutine. And yes, while that is synonymous with Quebec, actually Toronto has some really good poutine spots as well. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you exactly where to go to get the best poutine in Toronto. This may be a fish and chip shop, but it also makes a perfect poutine. People rave about this Kensian Market spot and how fantastic its chips are. Just add some gravy and Quebec cheese curds, then let the magic happen. So they have three different poutines to choose from. One is the vegetarian chili, the meat chili, and the Quebec style, which is, I mean, out of those three, it was kind of an easy decision. Quebec style poutine is always gonna be a classic, always gonna be good, especially here, which is one of the best spots in Toronto to get poutine. These fries are absolutely swimming in this gravy all the way to the bottom, which is great because some poutine spots, uh, you just get a bit of gravy on the top. It doesn't make it all the way to the bottom. This place, no issues there at all. This is absolutely smothered. Lovely cheese curd. The gravy is nice and salty. Great mix with this, these delicious, It's keep, it keeps going. How long can this go? Wow. That was quite the cheese bowl. First glance, this looks like a regular gas station, but it also has great barbecue from ribs to brisket, fries to poutine, and everything in between. But putting brisket on poutine, that is what makes this spot unique. If you see this gas station while driving, then pump the brakes and grab yourself a poutine. We are here outside of Leslieville Pumps, and I've got their best seller, their brisket poutine. Slow cooked brisket, gravy on top of Quebec cheese curds and fresh cut fries. The smell is, the smell is intoxicating. It's so delicious. It really wettens the appetite. Oh, and you can really smell the barbecue sauce as well on this brisket. Oh my goodness, look at it melting with the cheese curds. Oh, delicious. Mm. This poutine really is gluttony personified. Almost all the food items that I think of when I'm really hungry, slow roasted barbecue, cheese, chips, gravy, it's all encompassed in here and it is absolutely delicious. From burgers to poutine, Great Burger Kitchen puts the best ingredients inside. Their burgers are made with natural raised beef, and their poutine has the best curds you'll find in the city. All right, here we are with the poutine. It doesn't look that special at first glance, but sometimes looks can be deceiving, so let's see how deceiving these looks actually are. It's a nice creamy texture to the gravy on this. Cheese curds still have a nice chew. They don't melt too quick, which is nice. You, nice, you want some of that nice mouth feel with the gravy mixed with the cheese curds and the fries. The fries still remain very crispy. They do have poutines of the day as well. So today actually had a brunch poutine. I wasn't really feeling it. The regular poutine sounded good enough for me. The Montreal poutine. If they got Montreal poutine, sometimes that's the best alternative, unless they have pulled pork or brisket. Those are other good options, but they did not have that, sadly. But this Montreal poutine, I assure you, is absolutely delicious in every way. Nom 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 poutine is a mouthful, and so is their poutine. Generous portions that live up to its name. This little shop has been rated best poutine in the city on many occasions, and for good reason. They are delicious and affordable. You can even buy some cheese curds from the shop and bring it home with you. To me, that's a win-win. This tiny little shop serves some of the best poutine in all of Toronto. It's just a small shop in a little market on Dundas and Bathurst. And there's only one location in all of Toronto, but it's easily one of the highest rated spots to grab poutine. They don't have a lot of choices. And I asked the server what would they recommend the most, and he said people get the traditional poutine the most. They say it's the, one of the best traditional poutines in Toronto. I mean, I love traditional poutine. 
you know, all you need is good cheese curds, the gravy, it's fresh gut fries, which these look like they are. And um, easily, this is gonna be great. Mm. The cheese curds, they actually buy it from a small town in Ontario, and you can buy them right at Nom Noms. They have little, they'll sell you a little bag of cheese curds, only $6. I think it's a great deal. If you can put those cheese curds on fries, even at home, even if they're not the best fries, it would elevate the poutine to a pretty high level. Wow, these cheese curds are absolutely addicting. Wow, oh, they're just, the cheese curds are just so chewy and delicious. Smokes Poutinery is a well-known franchise that specializes in poutine. They've been making poutine in Toronto since 2008 and haven't stopped. They have more flavors and combinations than any other spot I can think of. I can't begin to tell you how many times Smokes saved me from a certain hangover thanks to their calorie-heavy poutines. We just got our pulled pork poutine from Smokes. The thing I love about Smokes is their variety of poutines. They have over 30 different poutines to try. Some of them are just there for a short while, so they'll be like special edition poutine or limited time only poutine. But I always seem to get the pulled pork poutine. I think it's their best poutine they've had there, and I've had a lot of poutine there. Always love the smell of pulled pork on top of these cheese curds and mixed with gravy. Nice fresh cut fries as well. And he had a fresh batch waiting for me. Perfect. Oh, I love real cheese curds. They just have this nice rubbery feel to them. Almost like a squeaky, you squeak it against your teeth. It's almost like, you get almost a squeaky sound to it. Nice, it remains really chewy, a little bit firm. That's the good thing with cheese curds when you have it in poutine. Make sure it's a little bit firm. You want a nice chew. And this poutine definitely has those type of cheese curds. Poutine with lots of variety, but made with care. This restaurant has a dedicated following that they earned by Six Burger Bar consistently making fantastic poutine. We are outside Six Burger Bar here in Scarborough. I've read a lot of comments from people who want me to go to Scarborough more often and I listen to you guys and I do admit I don't go to Scarborough enough. And Scarborough has fantastic food, a lot of hidden gems here, including this place right here, which makes fantastic poutine and has been actually acknowledged by Blog TO as well. They have many different types of poutine, but the most popular poutine they have is called Wing It Poutine, and that's what I got. So you can choose a variety of different sauces, buffalo, honey, garlic, but I got the medium sauce with ranch. And you see right here, it's got its traditional gravy on top, nice cheese curds your fresh cut fries with boneless chicken wings. Mm. The chicken wings are breaded, have a nice crunch, goes perfect alongside the squeaky curds, and the fries still hold a nice consistency. They don't get all soggy, fresh cut, crispy, beautiful. So if you're in the area of Birchman and Eglinton, I highly suggest coming down to Six Burger Bar. Easily one of the best poutines in the city. And it's in Scarborough, hidden gem. Their regular poutine is also fantastic, but if you really want to see what the hype is about, try the Wing It Poutine and I guarantee you, you will leave here very happy. There are plenty other poutine spots I would have loved to put onto this list, but unfortunately due to this pandemic, We've seen a lot of great poutine spots close in the city. But nonetheless, here are some honorable mentions, some of which that are permanently closed. What do you guys think? What's your favorite poutine in the city? Be sure to let me know in the comments, and I'll see you again next Sunday.